All right, hello. This is Queen of Pentacles, Sarah 333. Let's read. It's hot. I didn't want to be in the house so again. Mm -mm. <sighs> Let me see. Let's read, y'all. Evaluation. But somebody trying to figure themselves out. Somebody got to go to the doctor. Somebody got to look at themselves in the mirror. Feed out what doesn't serve you. Reevaluate the situation. Okay. Okay. Somebody could need a second opinion. I just heard it. Here we go again. These cards. Well, I'm getting the princess of pentacles. Okay, somebody looking back at money, money. somebody uh, reevaluating the situation, and they looking at money, money, <laughs> money too. And then they looking at, like, they reevaluating the situation here, and I um, guess they want to work with you right here. They see you as family. Okay, somebody trying to, like, you know, figure out what they're doing wrong in life and everything like that here with the Princess of Pentacles and everything like that. They got a lot of thinking to do then. Supervision. Maybe this person been doing things immaturely or, or something like that here. The King of Pentacles. Yeah, they reevaluating the situation. Okay. <laughs> Let me see this King of Pentacles. Okay, some about to get together. Maybe they um spend the time alone. But I do see them with another person. So somebody could be reevaluating another person that they working with. They said they're having good times. Hell yeah, they thinking about it. Good times with this person and everything like that here. They're spitting in good company. They by themselves right there though. Whoa. So oh. So somebody trying to figure out they self and I guess, you know. You know, they need new love in their life. So, and it's stuff they want to. It's things that they want. It's a man here that wants children. It's a man here that wants children and new love. And they probably got like a certain type, but they looking at you like they reevaluating the situation and they want to be with you because they usually, you know, don't go for your kind of person. They're going to tell you who they are. They're going to tell you. They're going to reveal who they are they're thinking about me and everything like that too though um i guess the way that they usually do things ain't working for them so now they're trying to look at something different you know you know sometimes people i'm gonna be honest they have like certain types i'm gonna be honest i even seen people base love off of money people's careers like if they don't, if, you know, if they don't make this much money or nothing like that, I don't want to be with them or nothing like that. <laughs> okay, and I even seen people base love off of skin color. Don't see me, no, you know, this color person. Don't see me. Well, love don't have no color and everything like that here. So somebody is like reevaluating themselves here because now they want children and everything like that here. I guess they ain't happy with the choices that they've been making the money coming in slow and everything like that here. So they want to tell you the truth and they want to tell you how, you know, they want to choose you and you something different to them because they use it on, you know, I even seen people, di you know, make choices off of people's size, you know, they'll say stuff like, okay, I don't want a big girl. I want a skinny girl, or if I don't want a skinny girl, I only want them big ones, or something like that, you know, or don't send me no short man, I need a tall man, he got to be six foot seven for me to be with him, <laughs> people so silly, y'all, well, I don't think love have no size, you know, you know, this my, my girl got to weigh 105 pounds for me to be with her, or you know, I like my girl big, you know, like I want her to have a juicy big booty here and, you know, or, you know, a double D's, you know, uh, you know, that one just ain't my type. 
Well, anyway, let's keep going. Somebody could be reevaluating the situation too because they're pregnant. And they don't know if they want the baby or not. Well, I feel like if you had a baby, got pregnant, keep it. God going to bless you with the baby. Anyway, let's keep going. Somebody could be reevaluating their job description, what they want to do for work. But somebody reevaluating life. I, but I do see this King of Pentacles. They want new love and everything like that here. And they usually have a certain type. Now they really evaluating whether they want to even, whether they type is the right type. But, you know, they type might just be the wrong type. Anyway, let's keep going. Maybe they just need time to sit by their darn self and learn how to love themselves. They need to reevaluate they self. Think about their money and everything like that. Because for some people, you know, every time I get with somebody, they'll use me or there's a user here, <laughs> you know, or this other, or so and so lied about being pregnant and wasn't even pregnant and everything. I'm reevaluating now my choices because this person just played me. They just wanted me to service them with the vendor. They wanted this person to service them. <laughs> they cheated on them with everybody. Let's keep going. Maybe that's why they reevaluating their situation. They looking at you and they want new love and they want different love too. Okay, so that's what I'm getting. Somebody getting new love with a person who is reevaluating the situation. They're trying to figure out what they want and everything like that. And you usually ain't they tight, but they trying to, you know. Okay. Anyway, let's keep going. So make the right move. So somebody playing a game here, but make the right move. All right. So somebody have like a, oh, wait. All right, y'all. I can pick up any kind of energy. And that's what I'm going to do. So mask their natural personalities, the conform of social pressures, hiding their behavior, a combination of mind games at play. Well, maybe they say that they don't want to be a player no more. They're not a player. They're just crushing a lot. You know what I'm saying? So they evaluating they self. They say, I don't want to be a player no more. I'm not a player. I just crush a lot. Who's saying that? Somebody said they fed up with they self. And they ain't strong. They feel weak right now. Goodness. But they're going to move forward. Here we come with this sun card. And the laptop. Lord have mercy. Who this? Okay. So somebody could be fed up with someone. Fed up with everything. What else? Somebody is talking about how they need time. I told you. Ooh. Y'all, let me pull some cards. All right. Somebody said they need somebody to be fair to them and everything like that here. Because ain't nobody being fair to them. They're doing a lot of complaining. I feel like at this time here, somebody is trying to approach someone, but the other person said, no, nah, not today. Because... Somebody just trying to um, spend time by themselves. So somebody got their eye on you, but the person that they got their eye on is looking at this, this person like they not even ready. They don't even want a relationship. But this person want to push towards you. And somebody think this person is a player. <laughs> Maybe that's probably why they don't want nothing to do with this person. Because <laughs> the sun card said, no, nah, that's all right. <laughs> No, nah, that's all right. That they look like now. Nah, that's all right. Like now, nah, that's all right, Flair. And it came out with space. Okay, so this person want to entertain you, but you looking at them like I don't know. Like you can see they like y'all just too different. I mean, something like that. Let me keep going. Let's keep going. I was at the other part. And while I was sitting there, somebody came and just sat there right next to me and started eating and drinking Pepsi. I was like, you ain't going to want to sit around me while I do these readings. These readings are creepy. Well, and I just got up and left and went to another part.
I could have stated that part, but I had went down the street and got me some water. Let's keep going. Let's see this evaluation. Here, judgment. Karma. Uh-uh. Somebody must can see right through this person who's trying to come on to them. Two angels. Oh, you intuitive. You got like spiritual protection. <laughs> Protecting you from this person here. Trying to come towards you. Here, they want to get close to you. They tired of you ignoring them. <laughs> they tired of you telling them that no, nah, that's all right too. Yeah, they want to offer you love. And you hold it back from them. You may not even be accepting this. It, well, what the four of cups, you're not. Here we go. A change in somebody's finance is good. I'm glad you got changing your finances. But let me look at this person. Good Lord. Okay. What's this conflict? Somebody fussing and arguing. Maybe somebody moved too darn fast. Here, they need to slow down. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Somebody here worrying about money and everything. Yeah, I feel like somebody could be, like, moving too fast and everything like that here. They need time. They do. So, Okay, Spirit is advising someone to give yourself some time. Give yourself some time and a break between, you know, players and users and stuff. All right, concentrate on your money and everything like that here. Okay, so show me this King of Pentacles here that's looking at money, money coming in slow, and they having a problem with money. They manifesting money, and ain't going to lie, somebody could want to take you on a date, and they got money. They might use money to get folks or something like that here, okay? I'm seeing this offer coming in. Okay, why is this people not on the same page with money? What's all this drama right here with this queen of swords and everything like that here, and somebody talking junk and everything, and somebody want to talk to you on the phone? And then I see the devil, in the, which is a Capricorn and Aquarius. Oh, and a Gemini. Hold on. Oh, child, who's this? And what's this Queen of Swords here? <laughs> Going crazy. Yeah, somebody need to reevaluate a situation. They moved too fast and everything like that. As soon as they did, they talking junk to the other person and everything like that here. And the other person talking junk to them. And what did you do? Yeah, somebody did. Somebody put on a mask here. And then I feel like at this time here, it's like they was together. Everybody looked happy to me, especially with that sun card. Then I see somebody complaining. But I see this person right here always producing stuff like giving and everything like that. But I feel like something wasn't fair with the re recipro re reciprocating. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this person complaining because they want to have more equal give and take. And then they said that somebody had put on a mask and they put on a show and they need to take a bow because they telling this person that they good. This other person here was fake, real fake. I mean, even if it wasn't a pregnancy, somebody had fake news, a DNA test that was fake or just, uh, no, somebody just was fake to another person. I'm telling you. So we got the King of Pentacles and this person was all happy and everything and celebrating well, whatever they chose here. But I guess they was moving too fast because they got betrayed here. And they disappointed. And they upset because I feel like soon as they let this person in, this other person showed their ass here. They cut up. Yeah, you deserve it. Yeah. So. Oh, because I told you that this person is like really... I want to call them, they fake too. Um, they don't base love off of love. They base love off of, I don't like this kind of person. They got to be a size two or a size um, 20. Okay. Or they got to be short or tall. Okay. They don't base love. So, they made the wrong choice, and it blew up in their face and everything like that here. And then they said that everything was fake that was in front of them. And this other person just wanted to be serviced. They wanted gas. They wanted lunch. They wanted food. They wanted to live with them. They was the devil. And then they got mad because they felt like they wasn't getting what they wanted and everything. And they started complaining. Oh, my goodness. I mean, they started going back and forth and being unappreciative and ridiculous and stuff. And the other person was just serving this other person. And the other person was looking at their bank account and it didn't look right. It was going dry. It was real dry. Okay, so now they're looking at this person like, 
you wasn't who I thought you was. You done gained a couple of pounds, or you done lost a couple of pounds. I mean, or you, or, or you took off the mask, and now I can see who you are. You know what I'm saying? Okay. But, but this person is a real piece of work. I'm telling you how they look, man. They look like Malik off the game right there. Because however they base they love and however they thought, whatever they thought they wanted, you know, it didn't work out for them. This other person said, you know, you ain't going to serve me or nothing like that here because they kept coming and they kept complaining and everything. It wasn't what they thought, they thought it was, okay? So they, they was like, I want my kind of person to not talk, you know, to not walk like that, to not dress like that. Oh, my God. Um, whoa, a big old, big old bird just flew over me. It scared me a little bit. Hey, birdie. There must be somebody. Whoa. Somebody got ancestors watching over them. So this toxic person here, who is? The money and the greedy person. The money and the greedy person in the conflict, they ain't see it coming. They ain't see it coming. This person couldn't be happy or nothing, even though they looked like they was happy. This other person couldn't be happy or nothing. This other person, I'm fed up with you. I can't make you happy or nothing. You was what I wanted visually or financially, but now I'm seeing you just ain't what I want. <laughs> Man or woman, you don't work. You don't do nothing. This person was feeding them gas. This other person said, I'm going to walk behind you like I need you and everything. I'm going to take everything from you till you ain't got nothing else. No wonder they need to reevaluate their situation. And they need a reevaluation too. They need to go to the doctor and get their brain examined. Because how they make their choices and then all of a sudden they don't go the way they thought. They said, darn, you took that mask off quick and showed your behind. They said they wanted to take. You want Eve for grief and take? No, this person said they want to take, man. This person greedy. I see it is. So, who are these two people? Oh, this is the kind of person, if you if you go against them or if you tell them that I don't like this or I don't like that, this person, all hell going to break loose, you know? That's what I'm seeing. They saw their behavior. They matched their behavior. But they under pressure, they, this other person just blew up. And they said, oh, my God, I thought you didn't talk. <laughs> now you're talking back and complaining. Now they want this person to go on somewhere. And it was a tower moment. Oh, that's their fault. They deserve it. It said you deserve it. I hate to say that, but my car said it. It says, you deserve it. Spirits and angels said that this person deserved it because how they based, you know, whatever they wanted. They need a clergy now. Oh, they're getting a reality check. They need a check. They're getting a, re they, they're getting a, reality, a reality check. This other person here, man, they fooled them then. And then it's almost like I told you so. That's what you get. Yeah, they deserve it. Light a white candle. Okay, because this person not sending you negative energy. Yeah, because somebody was just draining this person's energy. They were fake news. <laughs> they were fake all the way. Man, it's like it's like saying I do, proposing to somebody just because of what they look like or they was a size one and you was a size 22. <laughs> yeah, this person is emotional because they made the wrong decision. And everything like that. And the other person told them to get away. So the other person is emotional too because they was like, uh, uh I need you. So they chose somebody needy or something like that and was fake news. Congratulations. You deserve it. I mean, I hate to say that, but this was somebody. Somebody going to get mad about this one. <laughs> they all heartbroken up there. Yeah, now they want to see you. Oh, that's why they're choosing you. That's why they said, uh oh, let me. Um, okay, so now you got somebody who reevaluated themselves and everything because they had a reality check and everything like that here, and they went through all kind of stuff, and somebody blew up on them and everything. They got used, and, and they all broken down now, and they want to go and apologize, or they want to offer No, they want to be your new love. Remember, it's new love. They want to be your new love. Yeah, new love. New love. 
And for some reason, you're telling this person to go away, like I said. Because you know you ain't they type. Okay, you must know somebody. I mean, you might know that you're not this person's type. Maybe. Hold on. They ain't truck fans, man. So you knew that you know that you ain't they tight here. So you giving them drama, you giving them hell, and they walking behind you. Yep, y'all right. You so gifted. You never take work off. So you making excuses and everything like that. You like, no, nah, Betty. Maybe um, you knew this person for a long time, and they ain't never ever looked at you or looked your way at all. Or even if they did look your way before. Now they looking at you and running after you and trying to stress you out and everything like that and stalking you too. I'm not going to lie. This is a stalker here. They stalking you. They like, all my life I've been making the wrong decisions. I had to reevaluate the situation because I'm going through karma and I, I got used by an energy vampire. So I want to be a vampire to you. I hate to say that, but I'm seeing this what I'm seeing. Okay. You just calling them then to, to tell them what well, they trying to call you. But you calling them too to tell them don't even waste your time. Don't wait up for me. Don't wait, don't waste your time. Uh-uh, honey. Yeah, you for the streets. Uh uh-uh, you don't want it. Uh-huh. See, don't change people worried about it. Money coming in. Oh, they had to reevaluate the situation because you the princes of pentacles and everything like that, too. And you started moving on up. I keep seeing you going up. And doing good for yourself. And you're so talented. And you're so gifted. And all kind of good stuff coming for you. And this person's like, oh, God, I've been choosing this kind of person just because of that was my type or something like that. And now I'm looking at you like you my type because you moving up and everything. So now I want to see you and I need new love. And I, I want to love on you real bad. Real bad. I'm going to follow you around and everything. <laughs> She don't want him, man or woman, or he don't want her. Yep, we're not making love no more. Yeah, so because they got fake news and they got karma and the other person don't even like them at all. Oh, they wouldn't date tight. Oh, so you wouldn't date tight here. Oh, wow. And they just found out that whoever they was dealing with let them know that they are not they type. You're not they type. And somebody told them, but you ain't my type. I really don't like you. I wanted everything. I wanted you to service me and everything like that here. And then this person looking at them like, but I'm so I'm such a good person. And I did all this for you. They did a whole lot for this person. And but now they deciding to walk behind you like they want to be with you because they found out that they not this other person type who they running behind and everything like that here. That's who they was running behind on. The son. So you're going to have a big reveal about this person here that want to be with you and you're going to be like, man or woman, I thought I wasn't your type. Man or woman. You getting on my nerves. Mm-hmm. Gones, I mean, for real. This person just had a rude awakening. So now we're getting the Ace of Pentacles, and we're getting the star, and we're getting you get a victory, and we're getting you pushing people away, and we're getting you standing yourself and everything like that here. I don't blame you because you ain't they type, but they want to be with you. Somebody need to check this person's background and don't move too fast. Right, yo. Because you just not might not be they type, and then... You will probably be the one with the rude awakening with this person here. They're trying to offer you love and everything. Because I guess once they find something that stay tight, then that's when they're going to act stupid. Now, man. Oh, woman. You ain't they type. You just ain't they type. They need, they, they need a reevaluation. They need to go reevaluate. They, they head. They brain. HR. Because this person don't know how to be alone. They don't know how to love themselves. That's why they, yeah. 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 Man or woman. You know, some people, you know, uh, uh, be with some people and they realize, oh, 
you ain't they type, but then they'll try to go somewhere else and then they get their feelings hurt because somebody else tell them the same thing. Well, you ain't my type. Because somebody hurt this person's feelings. And now they're looking at you. I mean, they really looking at you, man. Don't No disrespect for, like, Malik on the game, but I guess this person played two damn games. <sighs> Whatever. Focus then. Because what's this, though? So they want to put a spell on you. <laughs> a love spell. <laughs> to make themselves look good so you can choose them because they know that you can figure them out. Because you're looking at them like, no, buddy. Or no, sis. I need time to think about this. So, ah, yes, they want to put, <laughs> put a spell on you. Oh, my God. I see, I see a spider. Oh, God. It was, it, I figured it probably fell on me. Well, let me keep going. What in the world? Come on now. Okay. I mean, okay, yeah, like I said, they wanted to put a spell on you before I got interrupted. Got a little spider. So they wanted to put a spell on you so you can come to me. Come to me, spell. Be with me, you know. I know you don't want me because you know who you know all about me. But I ain't playing no games with your baby, honey. Sugar, I want to be with you, no, nope. because I saw some trauma. I saw a lot of drama. I'm saying they did a little spell, graveyard dirt. I guess they want to, it'll make them look good to you. <laughs> I don't think it's working on you, though. Let's keep going. What else kind of energy we picking up? Yeah, unrequited love. You ain't they tight. Betrayal. Yeah, nah, buddy, I'm good. You change and flip the script on them. They disappointed. And they hurt. this has hurt their feelings. Here. You know, your wish is coming true, too, with finances, money, and somebody going to be a star. Here, you're going to get commitment. Here we go again with this old man. So this is Queen of Swords, Five of Wands, giving back and forth, and aggravated. Somebody talk shit. Who are you? What's this Queen of Swords? Sometimes there could be you talking junk, going back and forth. What, you got somebody jealous of you and stuff like that? And they want to talk to you on the phone? Or mad at you here, and I see a lot of drama. Yeah, somebody trying to offer this person love here. Yeah, they want to talk to you and everything they said, they crying and everything like that here because somebody turning somebody away here at this time. That's they show is it's victory. You ain't letting somebody like hold you back from getting this victory here. You're moving forward, you're going out of town here. Yeah, you told somebody no, you told somebody no, they worrying about that. Here, they want to talk to you. What's all this? Okay. I feel like it is a big reveal. I want to tell you the truth. Well, somebody said they know the truth. <laughs> okay, let me keep going. Who are you? Wow. It's the high priestess. So there's a love offer coming in to a person right here that's pushing another person away. And you chilling. And you got an angel over your head here. And this Queen of Swords right here is going back and forth with everything like that here. And they're having problems. Talking junk. What's this, King of Wands? Okay, okay, who are you, Queen, Queen of Swords? I heard you smart. Or somebody else. You never come see me. You never come outside. Somebody want to get your attention? Yeah, they want to play with you. They do. They want your attention. Oh. Oh, you threw them off. Somebody wants your attention bad. But you going every which way. You're so busy. 
and everything like that here you're keeping your distance from this person that's coming towards you because it's more than one person you having to fight them off and everything like that here for some of y'all you know because everybody running towards you here that felt like you wasn't their type or nothing like that now you're blowing up or something like that here you're really blowing up yep 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 you always busy you always busy that's why you never come outside because you stand to yourself and everything like that here and somebody really wants your attention and everything like that here. Mm -hmm. They flying mad. That's what they doing. They flying. Yeah, I've been driving around the world stalking you. <laughs> They've been driving around the world stalking you. They listening to you and everything like that. They want to talk to you. For real, for real. Who is this Queen of Swords with this dog on 501? Somebody said they feel entitled. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm jacking out to your pictures and everything like that because I went to somebody and everything like that that wasn't that didn't find me attractive, that didn't love me, you know, that wanted to use me, that wanted me to put gas in their car and everything and pay their bills. If somebody was a fly on the wall, they'd be laughing at this person, especially if it's an ex. Oh my goodness. Okay, some of y'all are gonna say I don't laugh at other people's misery because this person is miserable. Somebody telling this person no for sex. Somebody said I got what I wanted and which was money. Here. Why this person look miserable? This person miserable? Somebody show in. Because they just realized something that you was their type or they want to deal with you. Um, but you probably you pushing this person away. You busy. You always busy. Okay, let's pull a card on this always busy person. I'm too busy for you now. They ain't got no time for you now, honey. Somebody in the collective said they ain't got no time. They need a priest, <laughs> a mother, and a son. Man, yeah, you taking care of uh, what you need to do, man or woman. A proposal coming to you. I want to marry you now. Yep. They got that new beginning of love again. Okay, so you could be pushing somebody away, always busy for them and everything like that here. Right, it told me. You, they try to find you and other people and everything, and everywhere they look, they couldn't match you at all. But you show wouldn't they type. They're going through karma, they're crying. They're going crazy watching you and stalking you. They want to work together with you and everything like that. They see you getting a victory and everything like that. You've been changing lanes on their ass here because they're driving down the road and everything like that here. And you saw them coming. So you change lanes. You hurry up and change lanes and you went the other way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You said, let me hurry up and move. Let me hurry up. And run. You're running from this person. <laughs> this is that person chasing you. You said you happy and everything. You getting a victory with the Ten of Pentacles. You ain't coming outside or nothing like that here. You done ended it with this person here. They mad. They they really disgusted here because I feel like you know secrets got exposed and everything. You had that beat reveal. <laughs> they said, I want to talk to you. I want to tell you the truth. I want to tell you the truth. I want to be honest. You said, no, I don't believe nothing you say. Um, yeah. Yeah. They realize something that you turned your back on them. That's what they realize. Okay, so what's up with their new beginning in love? You probably like, damn, where you? Why you? Why you following me for? What happened with your new love? And why you crying? <laughs> Somebody a trip. They go a tower moment for their blood. Oh, you went out of town. Somebody just moved. They realized it. They realized you left. Or you dodged them. Well, you dodged them. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, they talking about you to everybody. You said, I thought you wanted to play them games. They said, I don't want to play no more. I want to sit down. No. Nah. Mm -hmm. You getting a public recognition at work and everything. You thinking about your money and everything like that. Here, you chilling with everybody. And, or oh, you just chilling by yourself because they say you never come outside. You never doing nothing. I guess I guess you were just too boring. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, it's almost like what you want with me. 
Well, all them people coming to you, you have to fight them off. Hmm. All right. Oh, okay. Okay. So somebody could be a constructor. Somebody could be a cook. Somebody could be a vendor here. Or what else? Somebody can like um do parties. I'm hearing a DJ here. I'm hearing I'm hearing DJ do doom 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 um now somebody work on computers somebody could be a star I'm not gonna lie with this king of pentacles let's look at this fed up energy I wanna see that what's this fed up energy and they overloaded and they got so much stuff all over them and they need to chill. It's fed up energy. And y'all, what's this fed up energy? And Queen of Cups, I love you, but you're fed up. Long term, yeah, this person disappointed. Four Cups, they upset. They want to accept something evil. Here, they like, I, I know my worth. If this was a job, you'd be like, it don't pay enough. I know my worth. I can, you know, I ain't taking that. What's this um, page of Cups? An ending. Good Lord. Fed up energy. If somebody fed up with the Ten of Swords, the Death Card, and the World, they done done. They don't come outside. They don't. Hold on. Your back is turned to this love offer. Yeah, they disappointed. Yeah, throw one on this Queen of Cups, sweet person. Sweet lady, won't you be my my love for a lifetime. I'll be there if you need me. Just call me. Come see me. Na 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 na. Woo! Somebody said you fine. No. Nah. They crossing their legs, sitting there. Yeah. Cause see, this person got their legs crossed. What's this Ten of Wands? A burden with the sun. Somebody look good here. The King of Wands. The sun, man or woman. I'm hearing Nathan. I'm seeing the sun, the death card here. Ten me more. The start. Aquarius. Aquarius, Leo, Capricorn. What else? What you fed up for? Yeah, they already in their head. They can't sleep or nothing. What's the sun and this King of Wands then? Okay. The Tempest card, Sagittarius Leo, working here. Something changed and everything like that. During your money change too. Somebody money did here. It's fed up. It's feeling guilty. Feeling bad. Oh, somebody like, they tired of their emotions. Somebody could be tired of their emotions too. Like, they don't want to feel hurt no more. They don't want to feel pain no more. They don't want to, you know, feel thrown away no more. They don't want to go through this miserable feeling with this nine of swords energy crying here, feeling betrayed here, you know. They ending some things, completing the cycle, starting another cycle here at Queen of Cups, ignoring this love off because you're disappointed and you upset. You're not going to accept no messages or nothing, no phone calls or nothing here to, you don't want to deal with this person or work with this person or nothing. That be everywhere. They get around. You're changing lanes and everything and traffic, running from this person. But I'm getting the king of pentacles. And then you seem like rejecting this person, making you blow up or do good or something. They said they're going to go to HR and report you to the office. Human, human resources. Okay, what's this King of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles? The hangman. You chilling. You getting a victory. Money coming and everything. You getting all kind of offers and everything like that here. Chill. You're doing good. Whoa. Whoa. Somebody here ain't. Who that? What the world? Somebody trying to trap somebody. Hmm. 
they feel like something ain't going their way. Somebody like, you can't get away from me. Well, they're going to jail. Mm-hmm. This person might literally, literally, literally chase someone. Chase them. Tell me more about this person dressed up and looking good. The king of coins. What's this got to do with money? You got the Midas touch right now. Everything you touch turn to gold. Probably so. Yeah, money. Damn. Woo, child. Somebody feel like something ain't going their way with money. Whoa. Yeah, they sitting there at the table and everything like that, but they ain't eating no food. Um, mm. What's this King of Pentacles? What's this, a rich person? And nine of coins. Yeah. Tell me more about this person here that look good. Um, the hanging man. They hanging too. <laughs> you told them to hang in there. They want to impress you, but it ain't impressing you. You got the mind to touch. Everything you're going to touch is going to turn to gold. Um, you don't stand by. That high thing. You real spiritual too. For real, for real. The hanging man is a Pisces. Capricorn. What's this seven of swords? Communication is bad. They can't sleep or nothing like that here. Oh, because they don't stand by? Yeah. The six of ones. The gypsy. Good Lord. Somebody a trip. What wrong with you? Mm -mm -mm. Somebody wants your attention. And someone wants to talk to you. Somebody wants to send you a message. Okay, yeah, they're going to jail. They're going to jail. Who you mad at? Because they crying. They need you. They confused too. They want to trap you. They want to make you talk to them then. Mm -hmm. They really do. Man, what they want to do? Tie you up, kidnap you? They really confused. Their tricks ain't working or something. Something changed. Yeah, man. Man, who are these folks fussing? Good Lord. Who are all these folks watching you? You done made a lot of folks mad. <laughs> whoa, whoa. What's this stalking energy? They fine. They uncomfortable. They ain't nobody never treated this person like that before. Nobody. Somebody wants your love. You need a restraining order. Somebody watching somebody like crazy here, boy. Ooh, they wanted to offer you this. You must didn't take it or something. Yeah, you pushed them away. They want to write you a check. They really want to talk to you. They, yeah, now you sorry. I knew you was going to hurt me, but now you're sorry. They can stay sorry. What's the seven of swords? Now, this person, they lie all the time. Oh, but I thought I put it on you. You ain't put it on them. They need you to relieve their stress. You a boss. Yep. They they hated on you. Thanks for hating. Mm-hmm. Because you wasn't their type or nothing. Mm-hmm. You, yep, you put them on standby because I'm waiting. They want to come. Yeah, they becoming impatient here. They want to argue. They want to talk. Nobody don't put them on hold like that. They're a whole hater and you know it. Hmm. You a hater and you know it. Clap your hands. They stalking you. Somebody told them all your business and everything. They got everybody watching you. You might see signs. Yeah, they're becoming impatient. They want to run. They want to run up. They want to run up on you. Mm. She's jealous. Somebody know this person right here, the other person. Somebody know the other person is watching you like this, and they upset about it, and they jealous, and they mad too. Child. They don't care what nobody say or nothing. They so frustrated because you they ain't, never, they ain't never been treated like this before. They feel like nobody don't care about them. Hmm. 
I thought you would just come right back because everybody else do. Because they used to people, the type that they used to, to, I mean, the type they used to, they used to, they ain't showing nobody attention now, though. Yeah, they thought playing games with you was fun, and they thought you was come, come right back. Wait, okay, wait, I'm stumbling over my words. They thought playing games with you is fun, would be fun. It was fun. And they thought that you would come right back. And they said they wish they hadn't have done that. Now you they type all of a sudden. <laughs> they see you got the Midas touch and everything like that here. Now they want to be equal and they want to um, help you out and do everything for you and everything here. Who this jealous person they talking to? <laughs> Somebody who was wasting their time and everything. <laughs> the Queen of Coins, which is the Queen of Pentacles. They say they got used and they need your help. That's the truth. Eight of Cups. They said they got used and the other person left and everything. They real mad about that. So now they want to stalk you. They, yeah, they offer love to uh, That's what they get. Even if you ain't never talked to this person, even if it's just a new love or whatever. Oh, my hand itches. Somebody finna get some money. What's all these folks? Why are the police everywhere? Because they got low self-esteem and everything, and they want to run up on you. I promise I'm so self-conscious. What's this cup of love? What's this cup of love? A lot of love. Oh, you thought you would hurt me with goodbye, and now you sorry. Weren't you the one? They thought you would crumble. They thought you would break down and chase them, and you didn't. Instead, you turned your back on them and everything, and you said, forget you, and everything. I thought you forgot about me, and everything like that. Well, I guess they did, and this is going to be a big reveal here with this talker, with the seven of swords and the lies. <sighs> What's up with this hater? Hmm. Let's find out. What's up with this hater? They fired. The hater got fired and following you. Ah! I'm sorry, y'all. I ain't mean to yell. Okay, I'll go again. I'm getting a lot of crazy energy. They could just sneak up on you then. Shit. Cause... There go the high priestess for real in the sun. Here with the four ones again. I heard they just want to make you happy, but I don't trust this person at all. Because they lie all the time. Folks just usually just pay this person attention. Oh, I said they were pretty. Are you pretty one? Child, who is this love offer? Maybe they are jealous because they think that you're showing somebody attention. Oh, the mother jealous. <laughs> Man, a woman or the dead one. I heard Owens. Somebody named Owens. Happiness. And everything like that here. Somebody is a trip. Maybe they just too immature for you then. They a baby. Okay, yeah, they a baby. I see the baby. They go to baby. Man or woman. I'm finna say this. If somebody is pregnant. Um, this ain't for everybody then. This, this is for somebody that is pregnant. Don't trust this person right here coming to you that don't want this baby. That's trying to act all loving and sweet all of a sudden. Meet them at a place where everybody around, a lot of people, and bring some mace or something. Because somebody want to connect with you for real, for real. If you got a child with them. But this person could be like, the kind of person be like, I want to see my kid, I want to see my kid, I want to see my kid. But they don't really want to see their kid. Tell me more about this person. Or oh, they just left? The magician. What happened with the magician? You manifesting a reward in your life. Oh, hell no. That's what I mean. No. No. The baby. Maybe 
They want to see the baby, but they mad at you for leaving them alone or because you won't open up to them because I feel like somebody is doing their own damn thing. Okay, no. A burden on you. You got a psychic vision and everything. Yeah, somebody is shady. Is I don't know what. Here, whoa, whoa. This could be true. Even if you ain't got no kids. Uh, somebody stalking somebody like crazy. Like I said, child. Okay, tell me more about this person here. What's this X of Swords? Conflict. What's this conflict? Moving on and letting go. Somebody can actually have somebody to come towards you here to get you outside. Whoa, they eyes is the way they looking is weird. Tell me more. This person can't move on or let go. The King of Swords. The Ten of Cups. The Ten of Swords. The, the King of Swords in love with you. Secret. Somebody hiding shit. What is you hiding? Happiness. They mad because you happy or something and you got spiritual gifts here and they holding something behind their back. What is this? Okay. Tell me more about these folks. The wish, the spiritual altar. And then, okay, this person here is delusional. Oh my God. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'm right. Okay. The wish, the spiritual altar. The fireman. This person is lighting candles. They're lighting candles. Somebody need to be careful about fires. Two. All right. You could be holding back from someone. Yeah, because somebody wanted a wish here. Either to let you go or to get you back. But I'm here to come. Because the way they look like they is want you to come to them. Now, this person is lighting the candles. Candles. Is um it's a man. It could be a woman. It could be a shady woman. Tell me about this person. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. They could be getting readings on you. You could have had a dream, a weird dream or something like that. Like, you know something coming. Like, this person want to, um, y'all. Bully you. Grab you up. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because you got self-care, self-love, and you chilling. Yeah. Almost like you looking like you know something coming. Here. Because they were showing up like a hater and then showed up like the king of cups, like they love you, but I don't feel that way. I feel like this person want to plot with other people. Got Seven of coins. They ain't confused for real. Worry about money too. Maybe this person just upset because what they ain't getting out of you no more. Here. You know. Now if this is a job, somebody do want to pull you in HR and get you fired. They drama. Okay, somebody could be mad too because you know the truth about them or see the truth in them and they want to bully you. Yeah. Yep. Yep, you yep, it's somebody who you could have been giving energy to, but you're not in it doing it anymore anymore. Yep. Okay. You let somebody know that ain't all about them. You eating without them. And thinking about your money. Somebody wanna write you a check here? Yeah, somebody do. Okay, man, somebody could want you to write you a check, um, give you some money here to deal with something, bribe you. <laughs> they like, here, take this money and deal with this person, please. But this person ain't right. 
<laughs> Something wrong with this person. Look how they looking. Like, yeah, what? With the Queen of Swords. Somebody's so jealous of you. Somebody is so stressed out about you. What's this phone call? Uh, oh, somebody want to get somebody to call you too. Like, I'm getting someone to call you to see what you're doing, getting your business, but you is ignoring them and answering your phone or nothing. Here. Uh-huh. You ain't opening up letting this person know your business or nothing because something is a trap. Like, they're trying to be sneaky and everything like that, and they're using another person who don't like you but comes off nice to you to call you to get you to tell your business to this person because um the only reason why they want to know your business, though, to see what you're at, see what you're doing, see if you're dealing with this person because somebody is stalking them, too. Somebody is stalking them. Because they worried about you. And they worried about how obsessed this person is about you too. So somebody was like, I really want to um, use someone else to call you. Because you probably comfortable. They want you to lay your guard down. They can't sleep for nothing. They're stressing their mind and everything. Because this other person is on their back about... Did you call them yet? Did you talk to them? Did you see what they was doing? And everything like that. Somebody is checking on you too much. You living rent free in folks' heads. Y'all tell me about this. Um, Yeah, somebody could be doing that. Like, using another person to call you to get you to open up or open the phone, answer your phone, but... Some of y'all changed y'all numbers already, but, uh, or some people done blocked this person. Well, that's probably why they look so mad, because you don't come outside, and you ignoring messages, and you ignoring this person's phone calls, and you ignoring the other person who want to talk to you because they just want to get in your business. Yep. That's why this person got mask intentions. That's why this person got masked and teachers then. They match they masking their natural, their natural personality to conform to social pressures. That's why it's social pressures too then. The reason that it is social pressures is because they want to um they working with this these other people to get in your business to see what you're doing here, to see if you are interacting with this other person because somebody show want to get in your business. You're giving them a hard time. They feeling like something ain't going their way and they feeling like you know exactly what they doing. They want to offer you money, bribe you, something. They are weird. Uh, they blowing my phone up. <sighs> Somebody is to conform to social pressures. Cause somebody on their bed. Somebody on their bed, these two people that's working together here. Somebody on their bed, like where she at? Where she go? Where she go? Or him. Or where he at? Where he at? Where he go? Hmm. But you know something creepy about these folks? These people? They want to contact you, man. Almost like you're being... You ignoring... Yep, you is. You ignoring this. Tell me more about her. Him or her ignoring this person. Wait up for me. Make time for me. I'm just telling you, don't. Spirit says don't. <laughs> what else about this person? Because your back turned. There's a message. There's some kind of communication. And you're just 
Yeah, because they coming up with um a strategy. They strategizing, you know, they, they play games with you. It's funny. <laughs> they is. They strategizing. They coming up, they, you know, in this little group, you know, they need they need some help. Somebody could be a Capricorn or Libra. Hey, somebody could be a Libra or a Capricorn, a Leo too. Scorpio too. Taurus Pisces too, Aries. Uh, cancer. They don't like nobody. That's your problem. That's, they talking about you. <laughs> you say, I don't like your friends. I don't like nobody. I don't deal with you. I don't deal with y'all. I just don't. Okay? That's why you trying to avoid everybody. They emotional about that and everything like that here. Because somebody was trying to make somebody to look bad, too. Mm -mm. It's annoying them. Is anyone around you? Why you want to know damn person business now? Say my name. What is your name? I heard Tasha. Hmm. You got a new car. Or you going to get one. Somebody is. In the distance, soon then. Tell me more. Oh, you got an old soul. You different from everybody else. Somebody jealous of you and everything like that. So somebody tried to lie on you. But if someone tried to lie on you to somebody, now another person is looking like, you lie, you lie, you lie, you lie, you lie. And now I, I you know, treated this person some kind of way. Here, got this, that, and everything like that here. Played this person real bad. And and now I see that you're a liar. So they're turning each other. Yeah. So they're turning it back on each other now. They don't trust each other. They just don't. They feel like, yeah. Yeah, this group, this people that's working with each other to contact you, call you, whatever. With this fake news. With this fake news. <laughs> they don't want nothing. They want to get in your business. And nobody never treat them like that and don't answer them. It's convenient for them. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Somebody cussing these folks. They cussing each other out. They better be cussing each other out. They mad at you, too. Real bad. You need to go see a doctor. That's what they need to do. They have an anxiety. You ain't letting them cause you no anxiety. I hope not. Um, okay, they keep saying that they don't like nobody. I don't like your friends. I don't like nobody. I want to get you by yourself and everything like that here. Or you probably don't like nobody. Somebody don't like nobody. Probably don't. I mean, these people look like if you got to deal with this person, you got to deal with everybody. The whole everybody. And you just don't. Somebody ain't used to you, like, being different. Yeah, because they with everybody. They with everybody, but these people shady in that group. These people shady in this group, this family, this job, something. You said I need my space. I ain't got time for that. After work, you go home, shoot. Hold on. Hello? Hello? Hold on. Hello? What's wrong? Working. Why? Oh, did you clean out my tub? Oh, yeah, I need my tub clean out. Oh. All right, bye. All right, I'm back. <laughs> you ain't going nowhere, really. Oh, man, I've been on Okay, let's do another one. 